Is that shooting at you? Well, no, that's me. Nope. I have boarded the enemy craft. I have taken out... Oh, oh, bad, bad place. <laughs> Ow. Oh, it's intact on the ground, though. What the... Right, I took out a missile launcher. How do you do this? Uh, it's called Great Skill and Alacrity. No, how did you do it? Oh, no! I got cocky. Ow! Oh. oh. Hold on. Um. What? Uh. Whoa! <laughs> Help! <laughs> it sent me to the underworld, but now I'm back. Oh, no, the drone's shooting me. I suppose you can distract it a bit. You like that? Yep, that'll do. Ow! Oh, I don't like playing bullet dodge. Ow! I can't get back to my body. Should I stop shooting because you're there? Um, stop shooting the drone, yeah. <laughs> now what? Do you have a grinder? No. What are you doing up there then? All my stuff's in that hole. I don't know, I'm going to try to coax this thing to shoot at its own drone. Oh, really? <laughs> Ow. Oh, I got punished for my laughter. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Why did you cap back me? Oh, I think the drone's gone. Uh, there's no ammo in here. All right, grinder it is. Oh, I see an incoming drone. Yeah, I'm at it. I am standing on the drone. Right, well, well, you got that preoccupied. Whoa! Um, you're taking some heavy fire there. Yeah, I was trying to drop the drone on him. Did Ow. not quite work. You okay? Yeah, I got shut up a bit, but I'm all right. Yeah, I wanted to see if I could drop the drone on him. I, I took the ammo from the uh, enemy ship. Our uh, bike. Hacking its turret, which is why the <sighs> rocket launches. <laughs> what? Wow. We do both bounce a long way when we get hit, don't we? So, one of the... I thought you were going to turn your little vehicle into a ramming thing. Well, I didn't, because I need to get my stuff. Well, your stuff's bounced miles away this time, so you should be good. Right. Just got to figure out which one of my corpses it is. One of the guns was behind one of the damage guns. So I tried shooting the damage gun until it blew up, and then the gun behind it immediately targeted me. Uh. Just one shot me. All right, stuff recovered. Back to the war. What the? Uh. I took out its antenna because I'm wondering if that's how it's calling. If it, if we take out its radio, if we'll stop the drones. Oh, well, it's. Gonna make it harder to target there. I know. You know, we could have been checking out a cool biodome right now. But instead you're like, let's go over salt to ground base. Ow! I mean you're not having fun doing this. Dying over and over again. Yeah. Sure, it's my favourite thing to do. I thought so. You do it a lot. Okay. Alright, I am almost at the enemy wall. Yep. Oh, you're just behind me. There's still another turret around to the right. Yeah, I think there's a few anti-personnel turrets in that, uh, that side facing the hill. Yeah. Uh, can you just give me a sec? I'll be back in a moment. I, I've, there's something I want to do with this base that I think will be very, very cool if I can pull it off. There's a weird cube over there. Uh-oh. What's up, oh? Ah, uh, it's dispatching another patrol. Dang it. I'll be back in a moment. I've just got to, just needed to get my health back. I got myself a bit of cover. Can you see the drone? Oh, yep. That'd be it. Oh. Oh, 
Have you disarmed it? Nope. But it's hovering above me, trying to shoot me. Just afraid to get too close because I'm going to get too close to the base and open myself up. Ah, it's disarmed. Oh, scrap. Thoughts on approach? Oh, I guess it wasn't the antenna that was doing it. Yeah. How oh, is this thing still flying? Gotta get this dang thrusters. Oh. Oh, it's going down now. Well, we could try to sneak in the back, or we could do a full frontal assault. Okay, full frontal it is. Mm, I don't like the look of these crenellations. Do you see that cube I'm talking about? Yeah. We should check that out after this. Oh, I see ammo. You do? It's on the ground over here. Ah. Radio tower. Alright, come back. Have you got a line of sight on this door? What door? The door that I'm next to. Uh. No, no, go back behind the little pile on you behind. So yeah. you're in cover. No, round the back of it. What? Round the- oh, what? the other side! Come what? out the other what side! What are you talking about? Yep, yeah, that- there you go. Now oh, you Here should... where I have no cover. Can't you get cover from standing behind- slightly behind one Just of those things? Just open the door. Alright. Alright, hold up. What? Ooh, more You ammo. ready? Sure. Breach and clear! What the? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> well. Made a big hole. Yeah, but it also got rid of the door. Whoa! Okay, there's a gun right there. Uh, do you want me to place another charge? No. I'm going to grind through the roof. Gun is gone. Okay. Is that a large reactor? Yes. Ooh. Fancy. Wait. 49 uranium. Yoink. Does that depower the base? No. The lights are still on. Well, that was a fun way to blast the door. Uh, so I do it to the radio tower. Well, it might blow up. Uh oh. Ooh. Yeah, we might be safer inside. Uh oh. Is there another turret? Don't know. I can't see one from here. Oh, oh something's shooting at us. Yeah, the drone see. Oh, this just goes straight up to the roof. I can't get an angle on it. Is it trying to shoot me? I've taken out its gun. Oh, wait, I know what I should do. Oh, do we want this large grid battery? Whoa! Nah, we got a rack now. I think I, I think I depowered the base. I took out a couple more guns. All the lights are off. Ah. 77 rifle magazines. Uh, where are you? Around the back. Around the back? You know where those anti-personnel turrets were? Oh. I'm just collecting the ammo from them. 
Since we're depowered now, we're safe to move around. Yeah, safe. Well, as long as I don't use breaching charges again. Hmm. So okay. You want to come in here and check it out with me? Really? Oh. Wait, how come these buttons are all red? Because the power's out. Oh. I turned the power off. It's an assembler. Oh. There's a gun over there. It's all good. And again, the power is out. It cannot do anything to us. Oh, bunch of missiles. Cool. Well, should we bring our big trucks over here and unload the valuable stuff from this place? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Let's just bring this thing down gently. Is there not anything else here? There's all these cargo containers. Where's the buggy? Just make sure you turn everything off turret-wise before we get here, because there's still a lot of hostiles in that. Yep. Well, that was pretty... I felt like we pretty, did pretty well then. Yeah, it was a bit... Shouldn't go for a while. Yeah, we probably shouldn't have sacrificed quite so many clones to that base, but... Still. I'm going to leave the chumper here and I'll load it up when I get the big vehicle over. So don't be surprised when you see a rover next to it. Open fire! I guess my uh, my truck's getting a large reactor upgrade at some point soon. Mm. Although, since we don't really need that much power, I'd be more tempted to go with uh, something smaller. Okay. I am here. Now I will investigate a cube of mysteries. It's just a cube. What? It's just a cube. It's just a cube here. Maybe there's oh. something underneath it. So it wasn't a cube like miles away. I thought it was something big. How big is the cube? One? Oh, I thought there was something else on the horizon that I'd seen. I don't know, but this is literally just like one block. Random. Well, that's anticlimactic. <laughs> oh, hold up. Bad. Oh. Snag it on a boulder. What? You should be more careful. It's very hard to see. I got here just fine. Yes. You have better visibility from your rover than I do. Also, this thing has now cracked 2 million kilograms. Sure. So it can't really drive up much of a slope anymore. It might need to fit some thrusters to this thing. What? Thrusters? Yeah. So that it can mo still move despite its weight. Oh, I really can't see a thing. There we go, that should help a bit. Give me your treasure. Found anything good? Ooh. Hmm. Uh, just, just some bits and pieces. So what stuff are you taking out at the moment? Yeah. Just doing some general looting and shooting. Why did you tip that thing over? Because I could. Uh -huh. well, I should have known. There's some power cells in these um, cargo containers. There's a bunch. There's a whole bunch of different random stuff in them. Mm. Like uranium and platinum. I feel like you should try your vehicle attack pro approach next time we go up against a base. Sure. I think it'll be fun. See how hard, how hardened and 
resilient you can make your little thing. You are emptying them before you grind them, right? Oh. Capac! Oh, I got the ammo. Stop dumping stuff on the ground and the thing's right near us. I feel like there must be something else to this place. Why is that? I don't know. It feels like there should be some secret. Ow. And how was this place repairing those drones? I don't see any repair gear. I don't think it was supposed... To, well, in the garage there was space for stuff to get repaired. Yeah, but there wasn't any machinery. Mm. But just a pair of big tyres. Can't fix a flying drone with a pair of tyres. But this was a ground base. Maybe it was supposed to go back to the... One of the air bases and it got... Confused because it's... AI or something broke. Yeah, I get confused sometimes. Oh, that reactor. Well, it's made out of heavy armor. Yeah. So if you want to grab that, it's kind of useful. Yeah, it takes so long to grind through. You are using the highest level grinder, aren't you? Yep. Okay, that feels better. Ow. Oh. What did you do? Apparently I dropped too far. <gasps> what was that? Me making a big mistake. Uh, what's on fire? Uh, my kitchen. What? What? Okay, first, <laughs> you didn't tell me you were cooking anything. It's very rude. I forgot there were gyroscopes attached to the back of something, they got loose and they damaged everything. Ah. Yeah, you gotta watch those gyroscopes, they're wily. Uh, dang it. That just caused so much damage. So, why were you trying to cook the gyroscopes? You know, I mean, full well that's not what I was doing. They may look like giant eggs, but that doesn't mean you can eat them. Although, thinking about it, I could totally go for a gyroscope McMuffin right now. Uh, dang it. So stupid. Can't believe I did that. Well, I did say it was silly to put gyroscopes in the kitchen. <sighs> Thanks. I told you so. It's really helpful right now. Well, it's <laughs> so rarely that I get to say that. <laughs> I know. you got to enjoy it when you can. Yep. Clunk. What was the clunk? Was that you? Yep. What did you do? I just ring barked the reactor room. Oh. And it made a satisfying clunk. Grrr. Huh? It's so boring. What's so boring? Grinding down all these heavy armor blocks. I can only carry like four. So I'm gonna grind down this stuff. Die antenna! Yeah, this is much more fun. I can go grind a mad! You are mad. Oh, now I'm even more mad. And I've got a grinder. Take that, catwalks. Fear my wrath. Oh. Full. I don't know what to do with this cockpit area on this thing um a control seat probably no oh, in terms of the general design I'm not happy with anything i've come up with so far um all right let me come have a look clearly you're in need of my wisdom and guidance well sometimes your craziness does inspire me to create something that actually works well Okay, so first of all, uh, first of all, where even is, where am I going? Where is this thing? I got is rid of it? it. I ground it off. Oh, well, makes it very hard to analyze something when it doesn't exist. So it's going to be up here. Probably. It doesn't have to be. Oh, okay. Could, I could make this whole thing left-hand drive-in, though that upsets me so much. So that's about the space that I had it filling. 
Wait a second. Are you doing something that's about the same as yours? Similar, but not the same. Because we totally could do something the same as yours. Since I have got the slightly rounded shape elsewhere, I could do the bubble on top. I guess. Uh, I was thinking more of like a bridge tower. Sort of like an aircraft carrier kind of deal. Hmm. Rounded shape I did everywhere really doesn't make stuff like this easy. Um, come back. Why okay. don't you work on making your rover into an assault vehicle? What? Your little one. Um... I guess I could do that. Um... The guy just work on it in here. What have you done to it? What do you mean? It's locked to the ground with this landing gear. That you just unlocked. Uh, I'd work on it in here if I were you. We're gonna need some space if we're gonna work on it. Yeah, there's plenty of space in here. And your cargo's right nearby. Yeah, not when it's locked to a wall. Eve is watching. <laughs> were you... <laughs> were you want, meaning to look like a dog that's trying to find a plot, spot to lie down? Something like that. Um... Hmm. Come back. <laughs> I just noticed something. Huh? I think I ran over a drone. Uh, what do you mean? As in, I don't think I noticed, and I think I ran straight over a drone. There's a divot behind my big rover, and there's a few pieces of a drone left. Yeah, this was the one I was salvaging before you got here. Oh, okay. I thought for a second I'd crushed it. Uh, uh. That wasn't me. That wasn't me either. Um. I have no idea what just exploded. Why is this turret active? There's a drone over here, but it's not doing anything. It's dead. I thought we depowered this base. Did you put power back on for it? No. Oh, the solar panels just turned on. Uh. So I think the missile turret that you repaired started shooting at their stuff. I didn't repair a missile turret. Uh, then why was I able to control it? Because I converted everything in the base to me. Well, that would be why. So the missile turret that was already working but was just depowered. So, um. I'm gonna get rid of the solar panels. How are you going with your design? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. What's mean looking? I'll, I'm interested to see how it will perform. Yes. Energy low. Aren't we all? <laughs> well, I mean, if, if you use it cautiously and approach like we normally would, it may well work quite nicely. Maybe difficult to get down off the ramp. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I have an idea of how to improve that for you. If I open the ramp onto the enemy base. So it's a bit more level. Well, do we have a target? Oh yeah, because you'd have to then drive the whole way to it, wouldn't you? Yes. Alright, we'll figure that out when we get to the target. Um, the target would probably be... Uh, another enemy ground base or something, I guess. Maybe. That's what I was thinking, anyway. Uh, didn't... Remember we found that other ba base that was along the way to the... Um, MRE place we were going to? Sure. Uh, I had another idea, too. Uh, oh, thanks for putting all the cargo containers out of reach. You don't have hydrogen? I was trying to move the weight distribution of the vehicle forward. Because it was way too rear heavy. Especially with an idea I have for hooking up your vehicle to this. I was thinking of acting like a uh, sort of tow truck. So with a piston, I should be able to lift your vehicle up onto its rear two wheels. 
which may make it easier to drive with it. Uh, what? So if I grip your vehicle on a hitch and then lift it up so that only the rear two wheels are touching the ground, I'll be able to steer much more effectively with you attached to the rear. Does that make sense? I don't think it does, but it, it might work. No. What's wrong? My plan failed. What plan? Nothing. Nothing at all. I was only asking to see if I might have had a way to help you make it work, but sure. You don't have to tell me. Yeah, it's not important. Okay. Well, it's ready for its first and final test run. <laughs> uh, just give me a few moments. Uh, are different materials heavier than each other, or is it just how many liters of space they take up? Different materials are heavier than each other. What's the heaviest thing? Uh, by density, I think it might even be steel plate. Or maybe grids are. I'm not sure. Shouldn't it be uranium? Oh, in terms of not just components. Yeah, uranium's the densest. Pretty sure it is anyway. Why? Oh, I'm just thinking about how I could weigh down the back of my... Um, you could about. put a... If you got... Since you don't really need the connector, you could get rid of the connector in the cargo container and put a large cargo on there and fill it with stone. Yeah, it should be fine. There we go. Uh, cut back. Yeah? If you're planning on connecting there, that's not going to work. Why not? Because where does the chomper fit? Up the front here. Uh, no. Not There's really. heaps of space. Actually, especially if this drives in front first, because then it can nose in here and have the connector at the back. Okay. And then you can park the thing over here. If you think you can turn around. And then with this thing, like any vehicles we make, we can make them with a connector on the top and then it can instantly pipe them straight into the, the storage. Well, I was going to mount some other connectors around there, but we can fiddle with that as we go. I'm much happier with how I've done the front now. Just got to put some lights in and mm. fix a few last little bits up. Mm, I still think it needs a visor. I know you do. I expected nothing less. In fact... I might even replace some of the glass roof with some catwalks. So it's not fully glass. What were you trying to paint? Well, I was going to use some paint to show you what I was talking about, but I'll just have to explain it. Well, I'm presuming you mean take some of these side ones and make a couple of little strips down okay, the side. So so at the back here, see how it makes a kind of, the, the single panels make a sort of horseshoe around this double panel in the middle? All oh, right, you would have put it as I'd a... replace those horseshoes with catwalks and leave the window in the middle. Oh. So that, like, the roof is coming, like, off the back here, but then it sort of merges into windows for the front. Oh. Yeah, that's definitely not what I thought you were going at. Uh, you re... Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sh Not sure I'd go quite that far. You know what I mean? Like I know what you mean. I know exactly what you mean. At a minimum, I'd go this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. And I might even consider extending it to this one and this one. But I'd start with these five. I'll think about it. I know what you mean though. Um, and there's a gap here in Mr. Railing. Somebody's gonna fall, that's a trip hazard. Yeah, you moved the med bay. I'm gonna die. It's inside, you'll find it. Well, what the? Maybe. This place is a maze. Did you find it? I found the kitchen. Help. <laughs> Uh, where can I fill up my bottles? Oh, here it is. Yeah, how do I get back to the hangar bay? What? That's not the right way. <laughs> Let me 
I'm gonna need some signs or something. Uh, I'm gonna have to show you around soon. Show you what I got up to. Yeah, it's pretty roomy in here now. In the hangar? Yeah. Yeah. That's part of why I did what I did. You can keep bouncing around like that. You're making me uncomfortable. So, come back. Is your vehicle ready? Yeah, I guess. Well, do you want me to show you around, give you the tour of my new designs at the front of the ship? Because you've seen what I did in here with the moving the cargo upwards. Um, You're going to need to turn that thing around. Oh, no, I can probably, I can get the chumper in here. This is really, this is really capacious now, isn't it? Capacious? Well, I thought you'd like that word since it's got capac in it. Is, is that what that word means, though? Yeah. Cap uh, uh, having of capacity. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Let me just look that up to make sure I'm right. Because <laughs> I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm right on it. Oh, I don't. Yeah. Capacious, having lots of space inside. Roomy. Yeah. What do you know? Yeah, sorry. I was right. It is the sort of thing that you would like. I'll have to do the lighting back here, but where'd you go? I'm just at the killdozer. Killdozer, is that what it's been called? I don't know. I don't think it's actually going to kill anything, so it's probably not a good name. Wait, you built this thing and you don't think it's going to work? Oh, I said it's probably not going to kill anything. Oh. It's not exactly what it's designed for. It's Unless not going to kill you? Unless standing in front of it as I slowly run them over. Like that steamroller in Austin Powers. Okay, so let's show you around then. So right. you built this thing, which is the killdozer. Yep. And then you can take either door. Okay. So you come up here. Okay. And we come out this way. Off to our right is the living area which you've seen, but it's now repaired and the kitchen is no longer on fire. Oh, well that's handy. And I put the clock on the TV because it's mm. on sleep mode. I can't help but notice it's still full of doom balls. Yeah, the doom balls are staying. That's really a bad turn of phrase for them. <laughs> anyway, back here, let's go. There's the exit. Yep, that's an exit outside. Mm. Come back this way. If you come up the stairs, you've got the med bay. Okay. And if we go up these stairs. With a lovely view the... over the arboretum. Around here, up to our new cockpit. Uh -huh. And yes, you gave me a couple of ideas about potentially changing some of the roof out for catwalk, and I'm going to consider it. Because mm. mm. I, I kind of like some of the idea of it, but it's just the execution I think I'll do differently to what you were suggesting. And we've got our little flyer battery carrier up here. Which I really need to have a connector for so I can get recharged, but I'll sort that out at some point. Cool. All right, let's return back inside. There's more to show. Back down our stairs we go. And then we'll go up these ones. And into our server room. Uh -huh. At the moment, the only script I've got running in here is an inventory manager. This means nothing to me. Yeah, it basically it means you don't make a mess of the inventory. You just watch me. <laughs> Alright, let's go down this way. Around the corner here. Do you want to check what's behind these two doors? What? Doors? Turn around. I already know what's behind the doors. You haven't changed this. It's the... Um, Capac, this is totally different to what was there before. What? Oh. These doors weren't even here before. Well, they were last time I came through and I saw them then. Yes. Where, no. where does this door go? That's not a door. Oh. So then we've got sleeping quarters all the way around here, including ones that look out the front. Oh. Yeah. Wait, how do you... Where are those on the outside? Then come up here. There's another two sleeping quarters up here. Wait, how many people are you expecting there to be? I don't know. I figured it was a big vehicle. We could have the capacity for lots of people. Mm. Well, so there. Well, I hope... Where is it? You hope the Doom Balls is don't Is this fall. it? Is what it? Is that why it says restricted access? <sighs> is this the liquor cabinet? Come on. 
Let me show you the outside. If we're going to have all these people over, we, we're going to have a liquor cabinet. So if you look at it from the front, I'm going uh, to put some glass across those three. So that it makes it a bit more subtle. In fact, I'll do that now. I go and... Excuse me, Capac. What? There we go, that looks better. And then around the side here, I might do the same thing with one by one panes. So what's this door for? What? Um, that is if we decide to build, build anything that flies in here, then we can have a flying entrance without having to open the ramp. Uh, so you're planning on closing this off across the top then? Yeah, eventually I would like to make this thing 100% airtight inside. Uh -huh. Which may take a bit of doing, but it's... I just wanted to give myself the possibility that it could be done. Fair enough. So what do you think? Better than before? Yeah, it's coming along nicely. Yeah. Except so, for this big hole here. Big hole where? Oh, that bit. Yeah. That's where the bugs are going to get in. <laughs> the bugs and everything else. All right. I'm pretty happy with it though. So now we got to get the chomper on board and... What the? Have you... Have you looted uh, everything? What? Why is there a trail of bits leading over towards your smaller rover? You what? Come, come over here. There's a trail and it starts here and it leads <laughs> over to your rover. What the? That... Um... What? How? I don't know. That, that, so that would have been the thing that was under the wheel? How? I don't even... That, the turrets on that thing are off. I have no idea. Do you think one of the drones was kind of like scraping itself along the ground and dropping stuff? Maybe. Because there's, there's a thruster here, so it looks like it was from one of the drones. That's so strange. Uh, is there anything else of value in here? Or have you pretty much ransacked it? Uh, I haven't really looked at these buildings. I've no, we should grab the conveyors. The armor blocks. So is your vehicle locked down? Not yet, but it should be in the right position to just lower that piston and use the connector. Can you lock it down, please? Uh, maybe. <sighs> I'd gotten rid of these landing gear from the front of this thing, but now because you've taken up the spot where I was going to put a connector I have to put them back on I'm locked to this wall done alright let's that shouldn't be rattling around that is good alright let's so bring in the ramp my flyers all loaded up on my buggy so where are we headed next are we headed to the biodome yeah let's head off to the MRA experiment site on the road again. Now, I am very, very, very heavy now. Oh, to the point I need stronger suspension. Hey, wait for me! <laughs> I'm really slow now. Yeah, you'll be faster once you get up to speed. Yeah, I've got a lot of momentum, but I... My acceleration is terrible. Hmm. You know, with the redesign I've done, I suppose I could move the ramp to the rear and go eight wheels like yours. A few people suggested it, and I was kind of like, I just kind of liked it on the side, though. I thought you'd said it would be too heavy if it was on the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah it probably will be. Alright, I'm catching up. That's right, I just stopped to do some salvage. Not easy, you really are catching up. Better get out of here before you run me over. <laughs> I should probably put a couple of turrets on this thing, shouldn't I? Yeah, maybe. Just in case we accidentally put it in line of fire. Oh, might slow down a little... Oh. I'll be fine. Hey, this is kind of cool. What? Can you see me on top? Why are you on top? You're meant to be driving. Because I wanted to put the turrets on. Well, watch out for that crater. There's a crater? I mean, there might be. You're too far ahead of me to even see. <laughs> There's no crater. There are a bunch of 
boulders though. Yeah, you gotta watch out for those. Yeah. Oh man, something's smoking in my fighter craft. Right, I'm slowing down a bit so that it's not quite as crazy for me to be flying around on hard. There we go. That's better. Now. Oh, I think I must have put the handbrakes on when I got out. Oh no, I'm going up a hill. Oh, right. yeah. Well, see ya. Uh, now play to catch up again. Uh, turret. Idle movement off. Range. Ooh, aiming radius 1200 meters on large grid. Hold up. I wonder if we weren't taking full advantage of our small turrets, because that's more range than we usually have. If your bulldozer tank doesn't work, um, hopefully it'll survive enough that we can rebuild it with a rotor so we can put a large grid turret on top. Uh. <laughs> and make it have... Because then it'll have 1200 meters range. Right. That'll make it really effective. And clunky looking. Yeah, that's true. We got a great big convoy truck. <laughs> yes, indeed. Yeah. Well, Which, next time, I guess we'll get to that MRE experiment site. We're just like that Mars Truckers show. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm? Does look a lot, a lot different now, your rover. Yeah. I think it looks much better now, don't you? Uh, looks a bit more industrial. Uh oh! You need to turn right! What? That's a tight squeeze! Okay, that's alright. I made it by a few meters. There was a boulder there. Apparently so. <laughs> I mean, it was hard to tell from the noises you were making. Are you deliberately steering into me? Yeah, I wanted to get close so we could get a cool shot. <laughs> but you keep steering away and making it difficult for me. It's because you're getting very, very close. Well, next time we will be going to the... Are you going to the ground base nearby, Marker? There's a different marker for the what? Aramari. I don't know. I have my... I... You've, you've, been, you've driven me off course. <laughs> <laughs> Angle left. Off to the MRE site. So next time we will hopefully manage to get there or get distracted by something else along the way. Who knows? There's all that and plenty more to come. And we and our giant rovers will see you then. Oh. See you later, everybody.